Right. Welcome back, mybottleshop.com. YouTube. We're back. We're back. YouTube <laughs> video review, and we got a cracker. Yes, today. we do. Marcus lined up. Bloody. Yeah, go so, on, go send on. the clever in. Ask me. Yeah, you right. are excited. <laughs> Bloody we, excited. We've got three of the world's best whiskies. Yeah. As voted by yeah. the International yeah. Wine and Spirits Competition. That's right. Uh, we got one bourbon yeah. and, uh, well, Scotch whiskey and a Japanese whiskey. That's right. And we're going to give them a good thrashing. That's right. Lock it real good. Stay tuned! Stay tuned! <laughs> Uh, set, uh, set the collab and rock the Viking here yes. on mybolshop.com. Welcome back. Um, now we, we 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 get you know we hear these awards all the time. Yeah, oh, um, man. Yeah. It, I swear there's a new be world's best whiskey every world's day. World's best whiskey. Or it's world's either world's whiskey day or yeah. tequila day yeah. or so, tequila sunrise day yeah, yeah. or coffee espresso day. Gin day, um, pancake day. <laughs> right. Also, the situation. change your undies day. Yeah, I mean, there's really, <laughs> it's different. Yeah, right. It's different competitions. Yeah. Also for the different yeah. whiskies and yeah. wines and whatever gins, yeah. whatever. Um, I suppose that to be honest, mm. the the uh, uh, International Wine and Spirits Combination IWSC uh, yep. held in uh, San Francisco yep. uh, every year is probably the one we give the most credence to, right? So when we're looking at a bottle and we say, you know, has it won the World Whiskey? That's that's what we really think. Of. Probably the World Whiskey, World Whiskey Magazine, and maybe the London Spirits Comp, but probably ones. But this is a big yeah. one. So, yeah. so when these guys um, uh, knock out um, World Whiskey, and probably Jim Murray. I don't know how you feel <laughs> you about like that guy. Jim, yeah, no, no, I love Jim from the Whiskey Bible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, he it's always great. seems to go for the same players, which is you know the American Big Gun Bourbons, mm -hmm. um, and then he, he goes for left field choices. So mm -hmm. what I thought we'd do today, Sev, the Calabrian, is um, maybe just. Look at each of these. What we might do is just pour them in the glass yeah. and just give our honest feedback. Yep. Um, you know, it's feeding them Aussie fellas. That's right. And we get to taste a lot of whiskey. So we can yeah. tell people, yep. you know, is that bullshit? That yeah. <laughs> that's that's right. Yeah, fair yeah. dinkum. That you know? doesn't line And you'll get a couple of notes. So yeah. what we'll do is we'll go through them one by one. Yeah. Okay. And we'll start off, with, I think, with the uh, boondag. Yeah. Yep. Do you agree? Yep. That sounds good. All right. Back in a sec. We might start with Nicker from the yeah, barrel. Yeah, cha change his mind. Just in the intermission yeah, that we had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was thinking this is a big cracking yeah, cast strength. Yeah, flavour profile right. type of uh, way to step it up, I think. All so right. so let's have a look at this one, yeah. Sev. You give us a bit of notes on this one. It's a square little 500 yeah, bottle. Yeah, yeah, it's small. So obviously from Nicker Distillery, um, mm. as you know, um, it's actually a, a blend of bourbon and cherry age uh, single grain whiskies. Right. Um, there's about a hundred different whiskies in there, believe it or not. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, there's I did, a lot not, going know, on I in did that not know that. Yeah, there you go. lot going on in that bottle. Um, mm. And it's not, a, they, they call it from the barrel, not because it's car strength. Oh, really? Um, no, no, okay. it, well, I mean, it is car strength, but not, that's not how they got its name. Um, it's a, a British 90 proof. Right, so, so it's uh, so British 90, so yeah. 51%, yeah. which normally wouldn't be from the barrel yeah. strength, would it? Yeah. So, hmm. there you go. Come in a box. Hmm. It does come in a box, nice yeah, box. So um, it's a... very popular. You know, used to, this actually used to be hard to get. Um, we, that's now, right. We were in a stock for a long time. Yeah, we? yeah, yeah. we were. But yeah, now I think, I, I would even call this a pantry product now. Whoa. It's everywhere. Yeah, yeah, mate, yeah. I'd love to have that in my pantry. Yeah. <laughs> I was going for the corn flakes in the morning. Well, mate, it's easily attainable <laughs> now. Yeah, beautiful. Like back in the day. A bit so. sprinkle on the old rice bubbles. <laughs> 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 that's it. All right, let's give, let's give this a good bit of a tucking into. Uh, smells beautiful yeah, yeah. and uh, does, does smell nice. aromatic on the nose. Yep, yep. Very mm. uh, grainy as well. Um, mm. well. I guess I get a bit of honey, uh, you know, mm, a bit of vanilla. Honey, yeah. Definitely vanilla as well. Caramely, um, mm. Mm. Yeah, but still the grains come out. Still very... very I, I, honestly, I get the vanilla pods yep. straight up. Mm. Um, not so much picking up in the grain. I was yeah. surprised they had grain in it, no, to be honest. No, it's very grainy. Yeah, right, right. Grainy. Okay, well, wow. okay, okay. So you like thinking grassy, grainy. Yeah. Well, let's give it a bit of a taste yeah, test a and walk. see where, what it's like in the gob. Ooh. Wow. Pretty good. I reckon that's lovely. Yeah. Um, it's got sort of golden in the glass, I noticed. Yeah. Just looking at it. Yep, yep, yep. Um, I don't know if that's coming through there in the camera, but mm. it's a super golden colour. Yep. To me, it's very, um, what are you getting on the palate there, Yeah, Seb? the palate, I guess a lot of like cakey, Cake, but cake, dry, cake. Yeah, cake, 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 uh, like, cake, <laughs> like berries, like dried fruits, Ooh, um, dried fruits yeah. not, 
not overly sweet, but is quite sweet. It is. I think yeah. it's sweet. But yeah. I guess you know. Mm. I think it's sweet. A little yeah. bit floral. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Florally. Yeah, yeah, yeah florally. Yeah. Florally. I, mean, I yeah. think it's man. I think it's a crack. Yeah, it's Honestly. good. It's good. <laughs> that is good juice. Yeah. Now I have had this just as a side note. I have had this before. Um, and added some water. I don't re recommend that. I right. didn't like that. Well, let's just give it a quick because yeah. you know normally something like uh, I guess yeah. 51, fifty-one. And this you probably drop a bit of water. Uh, let's drop, drop uh, it really. You can do it because I've I've done it before. And I don't recommend it. You, you don't want to ruin I, I your reckon, whiskey, right? Yeah, I don't want to ruin it. I didn't like it at all. all right, just um, it kind of turned all of the sweetness into the sure. more leather notes came out. Um, but it was too on the other side for me. Got too leathery and got a bit bland with the water. So if you do mm. pour water, don't put too much. Yeah, Maybe yeah. I put too much. I just um, put a couple of drops there, mind you, yeah. how much in the um, mm. uh, cup. But it, yeah. it, I'll say this, it definitely flattened it. Yeah. Mm. Um, and, and it brought out a lot more of the alcohol, uh, yeah. which is strange because normally water you put it the other way, yeah, right? Yeah, that's right. Mm. Um, it just said for me, it seemed to boost up the alcohol. Yeah. Gave a bit of a burn. Yeah. I mean, initially I didn't get a burn. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you got any burn. Mm. Um, burn. But it, look, I, I think, that, so this is this has been voted, um, I think this was last year's. Or was it the year before maybe? Or well, last year I think mm. Scotch whiskey of the year or Japanese whiskey or whatever. Yeah. Scotch whiskey, whatever yeah. you want to call it. Yeah, yeah. Um whiskey. was voted the best. Oh no, maybe it was whiskey, sorry. Maybe it was Whiskey Advocate magazine because I remember this came in and they had a big photo of this little square bottle on there. Um and we thought, Oh, is that really the world's best yeah, whiskey? Yeah, and yeah. Um, I tell you what, I, 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 mate, I'm gonna give it a cracker. Now yeah. we've we gotta give it a vote. We're gonna give it a vote at the yeah. end or now? Uh, well, you know what? We won't confuse people, so let's do it now. Let's do it now. Yeah. So we're going to give it a My Bottle Shop mark out yeah. of 100. Yep. Here you go. There's a bit of paper here for you, Seb. Thank you, sir. And uh, you've probably already got something in mind, so yep. we'll just smash it straight down on the paper. Yep. Yep. Uh, right, it's going to be a My Bottle Shop mark out of 100. So, yep. right. um, I don't know. I'm going to go 82. Um, yeah, look, low 80s because while it was good, no, definitely not world's best. Um, and look, it didn't wow me. Like, it's yeah. great. It's good whiskey. You've been always damping down on this. Yeah, though, yeah, you? yeah. I, well, it didn't wow me, so. Yeah, right. I got it at 90. Oh, um, oh, oh, I thought it's, you're going to find it hard pressed. Like, if I had a liquor cabinet, yeah. which I do, yeah. <laughs> full of <laughs> over bottles. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah, yeah, right. Um, I'd, be, I'd be reaching for this one more often than not. Uh, I now, now I like a bit of sweeter sort yeah. of whiskies, right? Yeah. So there's a bit of sweetness on that. Yeah. Um, I think it's, I think it's, wow. Yeah, I think wow. it's fantastic. Well, and no wonder, yeah. no wonder not. You remember in the blind taste mm. test, right? Yeah. No wonder that one world whiskey of the year. Yeah, interesting. Well, look, if you like sweet stuff, we're gonna be back soon because we're doing the. Whoa! How do you pronounce it? A boonak. A boonak. A boonak. <laughs> Whatever it is, a boonak. <laughs> we'll be back in a minute with we'll the boonak. Let's see. We wish. Back. A DH. Yeah, but I'm saying there's no, it's like a silent D. It's a boonak. We're, we're just trying to pronounce the a boon. A bo, how do you say it again? A boonak. A boonak. Yeah. Because you look on the, the, the canister. Yeah. It looks like a boonad. A, bo, a, a boonad. Yeah, but it's a boonak. What have we been calling it? A boonak. <laughs> a boonda. A boonda. <laughs> I don't know. You know stupid Scottish whiskies. Yeah. They have all these names. Yeah. Nobody can pronounce them. Yeah, and then well, you feel like an idiot when you find out what the real pronunciation yeah, 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 was. Yeah, yeah. We're calling it a bunda yeah. or something for all these years. You wouldn't want to walk into a, you know, the Abalau in uh, Scotland and be like, oh, you got some abunda. Oh, yeah, that's right. right. Abunda? What the hell are you talking about? Yeah. You mean the abunak? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there you go. Little, yeah, there lesson. you go. All right. So you so, pour this one up. Yeah, you tell um, us about some I'll tell, us, I'll tell you about that. Um, it's sure matured space age single malt um, for those of you playing at home. The abunak is actually a Gaelic word for the original. Really? Now, mm. as you may or may not know, there's like 67 batches in. So this was first released in about 1997. Yeah, well, I remember this from yeah. my old days. Yeah. So it's been around for a while. Yeah. Well, I'm, I haven't been on the earth for a while, so I was very surprised to mm. learn that. And this batch, what did you say? This is batch 63, so. Yeah. Mm. And there's, I think they're up to 67 now. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so... You know, the word on the street is if you can find a good 50s, it's apparently really good. Right. But, um, well, well, yeah, I, I mean, it's know. great to see they've been doing the batch numbers for so long, yeah. right? They were doing it before it was trendy, yeah, obviously. Yeah, yeah, right? that's right, that's right. And now, you know... Um, well, now this is rare as hen's teeth. We're sold out yeah. yet again, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The minute that it got world whiskey, world's yeah. best whiskey, we were cleaned, yeah. it. We were cleaned out, right? Yeah. Luckily, we saved one for our YouTube viewers. Yeah, that's right, right that's right. Uh, um, and I think each release um, comprises a small batch of barrels and they're aged between 5 and 25 years. It's always find that interesting. It's like between 5 and 25. So it's like... 
That's that's a pretty big variance. I bet um, there's not March 25 in here. Yeah. Right? <laughs> it's probably this much, yeah, right? Yeah. It's like, oh, um, you know, you could say any whiskey's aged between that's five true. and 25 years. Really. Mate, and they don't say how much could be two drops yeah, in there. Yeah. I do like this big um, neck on the bottle. Yeah, it's I don't know if you can see solid that. Solid bottle, eh? Hey? It's quite It's heavy. a solid bottle. Yeah. It's got this massive, um, I suppose you'd say neck opening, Ooh. whatever, which... Um, I really like that. Yeah. Now, Compared to this tiny little yeah. nicker, which yeah, is nearly well, yeah, you possible. Yeah, you bloody pulled that all over the well, table. Well, it's nearly impossible yeah. to pour. You need like a pouring yeah. spout in there. Yeah. You know, now, you said you like sweet stuff before. Have a whiff of that. Mm. That's like... I said cake, but mate, that, oh, that's not cake mate. compared to this one. This what do they call the um, Chris, yeah, uh, peanut brittle or whatever? The sweet, the, the peanut in yeah, the yeah. sweet peanut. top caramel brittle? Or yeah, whatever. lovely, lovely. Like Reese's or whatever. Oh, Reese's, yeah, that's yeah. right. I get Reese's um, on the nose. I right? get like Christmas cake. Like this is mm. ultra fruity. This is, um, this is... My God, that's Christmas cake in a bottle, Yeah, isn't yeah, it? literally. It's like Christmas pudding with like... Oh. Uh, vanilla essence mixed in oh, and... Um, now you're talking, mate. Um, What's the the um what's mm. the, the powdered the sugar powder the white stuff what's that called uh, the, the powder uh, vanilla icing vanilla oh yeah icing. vanilla icing on, on Christmas pudding oh. that's what this smells like mm, you're right yeah. about that yeah. it's um sort of a golden color again I don't know if that's coming through I'm yeah. surprised looked a bit darker in the yeah. bottle maybe but yeah. in the glass it's quite um yeah it's mm. it's got a good golden yeah, tinge yeah golden but mm. dark a little bit darker mm, darker, than, yeah. Yeah, darker than golden um. This is phenomenal. Honestly, oh, this reason. is amazing. That is good, I this tell you is, what. This uh, is... Oh. Man. Matured this in Spanish up, Oloroso sherry butts. Yep. 61%. Yeah, yeah, 61%. So, you know, it's definitely got a bit more of a hit on it. But, you know, that the, the last the nicker from the barrel gave you a bit of a burn. This was a bit more smoother. Yeah, it's but, not... And, I'm, even though it's higher proof. I know. I'm not getting yeah. a burn on it at all, to be honest. Mm. Um, it, it grabs your mouth. Mm. Um, it's really grippy inside your yeah. mouth, yeah, obviously, yeah. with 61%. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to throw a bit of water in mine. Got a bit of legs got, on it, too. It's got that legs stress. running all over the glass. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What do you reckon with the water? Well, you know, something 61%, yeah. you know, Probably you, you have to really put some water in there yeah. just to open it up a bit. Yeah. Straight away, straight away, I could feel it mm. um, smooth out, yeah. open up the flavour. Yeah. I'm getting more yeah. of that real sherry coming yeah, through now. Yeah, that's right, sherry, citrusy flavour, yeah. oh, yeah. almost Pe like orange peels. Yeah, yeah. pecan nuts, yeah. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. really, really juicy raisins. Yeah, 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 you know, yeah. like yep. chewing down a juicy. Yeah. You know, when you're school and you had little buddy packets of raisins, right? <laughs> yes. Throw a few of those yeah, in your yeah. mouth. Yeah, whole pack of sunbeam, you just like, yeah. Bang, neck yeah, it down. That's a, that's, one go. that's a. <laughs> A uh, boonak, um, yeah. yeah, buddy, mm. straight up. So that's Abelau, another good. I mean, I'm a fan of Abelau, but mate, oh, that's cracking. Mate, we got to give that yeah. a my bottle shop mark. Yeah, um, um, yeah. out of 100. Uh, again, this has just been voted World Whiskey of the Year. So we're, yeah. what are we now? September 2020. If you're watching it later, yeah, yeah. Um, literally it sold out before I think the release, yeah. even the notice came yeah. out. We got cleaned out. Yeah, yeah, yeah Couldn't yeah. order any more. Yeah, gone, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, it's yeah. always been a tough one. Oh, I probably can't run that because uh, it's coming through on the other side. Right, so. right. So I'm going to give it a. All right, you go first. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw what you wrote down yeah, there. Yeah. I'm giving it a 94. Yeah. Um, you know, I probably even could have been, I probably could have even gone higher. Yeah, yeah I, I thought mean, the same. It's not, what's the fault about? Yeah. Beautiful big bottle. Yeah. It's like 150 bucks or something in Australia, yeah. so it's pretty cheap. Yeah. Well, by Australian standards, great. You, you made me change mine. <laughs> I wrote 95. You're a big fan of this. I, I wrote 95. Oh, you got up to 96. I've changed it to 96 because to what 96. you just said, uh, I can't fold it. Like, really? What? I mean... Really, yeah, honestly, yeah, yeah. mate. Yeah, bang mate, for your buck. I don't mate, know. Whatever the price is, it's, well, mate, it's worth like triple that. Yeah, we've had four hundred dollar yeah. whiskey, yeah, or yeah. our buy four, yeah. five, six, seven hundred, eight hundred dollar yeah, whiskeys, yeah, 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 yeah. haven't we? Yeah, that aren't as good as this. Yeah, that's right. That's um, right. Now, yeah. unfortunately, this is a shame with a lot of things, whiskey and wine in particular. Mm. As soon as these wines or whiskeys win the award, or win the yeah. the book award, or Halliday or uh, yep. Jim Murray yeah, or yeah. Someone, whiskey Someone advocate. in the know, adv you know, Bang. recommends it. It's cleaned out. So yeah. this is another massive problem. Is here we're doing a YouTube video about yeah. it, which we'd already had this bottle put aside. Yeah, we did. Out of our supply. Yeah. And we're cleaned out. Yeah. So everybody jumped on it. That's right. And yeah, there will be more in future. There will be more, but 61%. They're yeah. not, you know, they're yeah. not pumping out this... There's no shipping container coming over yeah. here full of uh, yeah, yeah. abunak, right? Be, I hope there so. should be. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, that one's done. All right. So what What's we'll do next? is we'll yeah. take a quick break, yeah. 
um, maybe clean the palate, clean the palate mm. and then we're going to come back with the bourbon, Ooh. which was voted uh, world's best whiskey. Nice. Nice. All right. Back in a minute. What we got now? So we're back uh, here now for our third in our uh, world's best whiskey uh, compilation, I guess we'd say. And this time we've got a bourbon. Now, the thing is, you know, depending if you go to America, um, and, uh, and, and probably, you know, if you're looking at Whiskey Advocate magazine, um, and even, honestly, even International Wine and Spirits and even Jim Murray, I always thought that those, uh, organisations really gave, they really leaned heavily towards bourbon. So yeah. when it comes to just what's the best whiskey, yeah, whether yeah. it doesn't matter if it's Scotch, yeah, Japanese, yeah. Australian, yeah. whatever, it always, nearly always seemed to be bourbon. They looked after their own backyard. Yeah, well, yeah, <laughs> Try and push right. themselves well, along. Is Jim Murray, is he, is he, is he um... See a yank. I thought he maybe. I thought he was Scottish. Jim Murray. I don't know. Actually, that's true. I'm not that's sure. true. Whiskey yeah. Bible. Maybe he's American. Yeah. Um, but he always favours like you know um, Stag and mm. um, yeah. uh, the other bourbons. Yeah. Sazerac. Yeah, Sazerac. William yeah. Larue yeah. Weller. Yeah. Larue yeah. Weller. Well, Larue Weller. Buffalo Trace Distillery. Buffalo Trace. They're Buffalo. always up there. Aren't right, they? right. And so this product. Yeah. Um, it's a Buffalo Trace That's product, right. right? We picked one from the same mold. Pa Papi Van Winkle. Well, this was recently announced. Um, world's best whiskey by who was it? International Wine and Spirits Competition. Um, and it's it was right, given ninety five or ninety six out of a hundred. And this is blind taste testing, wow. so they didn't know what it was. Wow. Um, oh, as you know, it's a bit of a Seb, mark. Yeah. Seb, you know that yeah. I've been a secret admirer oh. of this for years. Avid uh, fan. Avid fan, and yeah. I, it's one of these bottles that I would open, and you know, it's again very hard to get. Yeah. I mean, here in Australia, we got cases of it here on the floor. Yeah. If yeah. anybody wants it. Yeah. <laughs> right, yeah. in America, yeah. you line up around. Yeah. You want one of these bottles, right? Yeah. You literally, you got to go into a lottery, yeah. Yeah. or you got to line up around the yeah. block. Any yeah. of these here, I've seen it everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but yeah. we obviously get our allocation through. Um, uh, yeah, South Australia, which is yeah. Sazerac or yeah. whatever Australia, and we get a good allocation here. Yeah. Um, now, the first thing I know, it's got a nice long neck. Yes, so it easy does. to pour. Does. Nice um, and um, well, easy to pour. It's a yeah, long yeah, neck. Yeah, yeah, nice um, uh, golden colour once again. Nice golden colour. Yep, yeah, huge, brown. huge, sweet. Um, uh, jube, what's the, what's the lollies, you know? Jubes. Jubes, like raspberry mountains or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> you know what yeah. Raspberry mountain yeah. aroma coming out of the bottle. Yeah, it. yeah, it's quite a sweet aroma. Um, sweet, yeah. Um, yeah, and it's 50%. Uh, yeah, it's in bottled in bond, bond. bond. That's bond. right, we That's should right. add it's bottled in bond. So same, that means um, uh, same, yeah. same, uh, it's distilled in the same vintage from the same year. So basically they cut the corn, whatever, yeah, yeah, put yeah. in the, um, uh, still, and yeah. they do it for that particular season. So if it's yeah. winter or yeah. um, uh, autumn or whatever, that's that particular yeah. bottled in bond. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and 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 it's always fifty percent or above to be yeah, bottled yeah, in yeah. bond. So yeah, and um, made you know first I guess color. introduced by Mr. Taylor himself. Yeah, yeah Mr. Taylor. the name E H Taylor. He worked for Buffalo Trace Distillery yeah. back in the day. Um, for all the users in the know, uh, it does come from Warehouse C, in which he bought. He he built himself rather, right? Um, because obviously Buffalo Trace is bloody huge. Mm. Um, yeah. Well, they make tons, don't they? Oh, Harpy Van Winkle, so, Buffalo so Trace, yeah, yeah. Sazerac, yeah. Uh, Weller. Yeah. It just goes on and on yeah, and on. Yeah. And on now, on, traditionally, what my opinion is, that, you know, this EH Taylor doesn't line up to a lot of those other bottles. Well, um, you know, we've yeah, had the Stag well, here. We, well. We've had um, William Larue Weller. Well, look, uh, you know, oh, oh, well, this is a battle we got going on here. <laughs> you know, I don't yeah. agree with that. Now, yeah, well, now the go. sales, this product in Australia, tell us, you know, you're right. Yeah. The people just <laughs> won't cop it, maybe a bit too sweet. Yeah. Uh, is it maybe the price? Maybe price. Maybe. This is a $300 bottle. Yeah. Um, so, so people. But to be fair, some of those other bottles are like six, seven hundred dollars these days. Well, Eight hundred dollars, thousand. Well, I tell, look, I, you know, yeah. I, I, I was at a, a tasting event where you know, uh, twenty puppy, twenty, twenty-three, yeah. uh, the ten, which was hot, the twelve, the yeah. twenty, and the twenty-three, and this, this cleaned up all of those. Yeah, so. right. Um, but that's my personal opinion. Yeah. Oh, the bourbon's a bit sweeter, and yeah. I know yeah. you got those ra raspberry mountains. Yeah, yeah, the smell very, right. yeah, very, very, very sweet. sweet. Yeah, very sweet. Very sweet. Uh, um, which you always say about Buffalo Trace anyway. Yeah, that's right. That's right. right. I do you always say that about Buffalo. I think it's this, a wheat bourbon. Yeah, yeah, right? that's right. But this has got, uh, got, I guess, a lot more like honey coming out. Um, mm. More like for a bourbon, you don't really get too much of a fruity um, mm. smell. But this, you know, I don't know what you're going to say, and probably you know, a lot of Aussies will go, oh. 
it's not bourbonish, bourbony enough, right? I took the words out of my mouth. All right, it's not, but you. Yeah, that was my next line. Right, Australia, we <laughs> want buddy Jack Daniels. Oh, my yeah. Jack Daniels is like buddy um, carrot cake, yeah. banana cake, yeah, banana yeah, cake. Yeah, that's so, right, that's right. But, but it, we want a bourbon hard edge, and yeah, this has just yeah. got that, um, yeah, it does have that. toffee sweetness, mm, um, toffee, candy yeah, floss yeah, candy almost. Candy floss, it's yeah. sweet ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet ass. Yeah, now, is the taste the same? Well, I I reckon some of these I've had a few of these bottles over the years, and I reckon they do they obviously vary. A single barrel, this is a particularly sweet one. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, I don't mind it because you know I can sit down. I don't have to worry about water. Mm. I just yep, I probably yeah, would have it in a single old fashioned. Yeah. Um, and I just sip on that. I'd like yeah. watch Netflix. I'll be happy with yeah. Larry. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, wouldn't stress about. I'll get burned. I'll get knocked out. But. Yeah. Look, I think for this, just tasting it, I don't particularly like it. But I will say one thing that surprises me is for a you know a bottled in bond, 50% bourbon, mm. it certainly doesn't taste like it. Uh, but it's still got a bit of meat on the bones. Yeah, a little bit. It's got a bit of meat a on the bones. Bit, you get a little bit of fur, you get a little bit of fire there, right? Uh, a tiny bit, mm. but honestly, I don't think it's very strong at all. Mm. Um, it's not a particularly, while the taste lingers in your mouth, it's not a particularly long finish. Mm. Um, I just, I don't think it tastes like a bourbon that I, you know, that I'm into. Mm. Um, I don't know about the you know the price point. It might be you know well, very expensive for some, but yeah, I mean you're right here in the sense that it's been um, you know if there's any Americans watching it, we've got cases of stuff just lying around, yeah, along with blantons and yeah. <laughs> you know all sorts of things we can't yeah, give them away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but Americans, you know, traditionally what they're used to. I mean, if you just talk about beer, their their beer compared to our beer, it's kind of paints the picture. Doesn't well, it? You're starting a bloody culture war. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but again, beautiful yeah. packaging. I love the dice tall bottle, mm. and it's got the the paper seal coat and it's got a cork in it yeah. uh, i love the nice tall western bottle i really love that in fact i've got one of these as a water bottle yeah, oh, really? it's, yeah well, it's That's super cool. easy to pour yeah. and it's you know I, I, i'm a big fan of it yeah. so what we're going to do yeah. we're going to obviously give my bottle shop mark yeah. here yeah. and i'm tipping this is going to be controversial yeah. this is going Friday. to be controversial yeah there could be rumble going on yeah. here after this yeah <laughs> so yeah. i guess based on all my points i'm giving this a 78 Whoa, um, that's ridiculous. Yeah, it's very low. Uh, that's criminal. Yeah, I just not all a right, fan, really. All right, Buffalo Trace, I'm going to take him out the back after this. Yeah. I don't know if you can read that. I'll give it a 93. Um, I think it's every bit World Whiskey of the Year. And I reckon if you sank into that, yeah. um, and it was the right time of day, and you didn't know what it was, a blind taste, you'd be thinking, wow. What's this? What is this? Yeah. You know, it's sweet. I do think they vary a little bit with the barrels. So, um, you know... Uh, a bit like the the, the buff, uh, what was it the the um uh, oh, uh, the stag, yeah, stag, the stag yeah, the bottle stag. we had, yeah, which yeah, was down yeah, a bit yeah, this year yeah, as well. Yeah, wasn't, that's right. It, it wasn't went one of the, the better bookers. ones, yeah. like, but yeah. that's like wine, you know. Yeah, you get a good bookers, vintage yeah. or bookers. That's what, mm. you get all these things that are all um, it's like wine. They have different vintages, yeah. different production. They taste different. Yeah, taste different yeah. So each one of these is going to be different. Yeah, well, I think it's a good product. Yeah. I think they got you. You got one of your stash. You got the some one of these secret bottles. Uh, in your little mini stash. I do. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I do a little taste of it. Yeah. So, so they have this see, a tornado see and a few other good things happening yeah. there. So. Well, there All you right. go. That's, that wraps it up. I mean, well, there's a lot we, to get through, but yeah. we, I know we kind of sped through it a little bit um, this time through, around. Yeah. There's, there's three you know, really lovely mm. whiskeys to go through. So you know, we do want to try and keep it short and mm. sweet without boring you guys that's too right. much. That's right. Um, but you know, in saying that, I hope you enjoyed it. Mm. And, um, yeah, well, that's right. I hope you enjoyed it. And, um, you know, we don't want to do boring wine videos like, you know, we did the Italian wine thing. We got cane. Hey, that. that wasn't boring. <laughs> no, it's great. Great wine too. Um, so, yeah, if, if there's comments um, that people want to put in, yeah. what they'd like to see on yeah, our channel, yeah, yeah. I, I don't know, you can see around here in the YouTube, whatever. Well, Maybe yeah. one day we'll do a pan and we've got, we got heaps of options here. So, yeah. you know, if there's any feedback, we'll let you guys drive. What, what, right. You know, yeah. if in Australia, what do you want to see us That's review? Right. That's right, yeah. Um, yeah. Whether it's gins or wines yeah. or bourbons yeah. Yeah. or yeah. whatever, we'll That's give it right. a crack. That's right. Beers, we'll, we'll, mate. Yeah. Well, yeah, you, if people want more, more beer stuff, you know, I think we've only done like one or two beers and, yeah, well, you know, well, I don't know if these videos will really, mate, you know, if they really appeal to the people out well, there. Well, that's like, true. They're pouring they in here all the time, yeah, you know, people yeah. want to know about it. Yeah. 
a car show. We've got so yeah. many beer, cra yeah. big Australian craft beers yeah. pouring oh, in your There's like a, a new one coming every day. Every day, literally. Yeah. Literally. That's right. All right, so right. Sev. What are they going to do to the button this week? Right. Well, I'm thinking uh, uh, G. Yeah. I should say W, really, for World Whiskey. World right? Whiskey, all right. So already W. Wallop uh, that button. Wallop. <laughs> that is gold. Whittle, whittle, whittle away, whittle away, that, away button. that button. Yeah, yeah. Uh, wince on the button. <laughs> wince on the button. Win if you hit the button. Yeah, win if you hit the button. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, no scams here. No, no whinging when you hit that button. <laughs> uh, well, I think wallop's the best. Uh, whack, whack. <laughs> whack the that's a good one. Whack the yeah, button! Yeah, there you go. Right, yeah, uh, order no whack or wallet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, I think you, it's close. Yeah, I think I you like, win that. I like, like whack. I like wallet. Like whack a mole, whack a button. Whack, whack a button. Whack a button. Whack -a -button. <laughs> Subscribe so we get our count up. Yep. Uh, we can convince um, some of our liquor supplies to give us more stuff. Yep. Um, hopefully for free, we don't have to pay for it. That's right. Yeah, that's <laughs> we it. pay for all these. But yeah, that's uh, right. if we get more subscribers, uh, you guys can join in and yep. we have some virtual tastings or whatever. Yep, so. That's it. Thanks, Sev. Thank you so much. Cheers. Until next time. Until next time. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.